In this lesson, we'll cover how to add suggested properties that are useful for project management. Properties associated with tasks and projects power custom views in your project workflows. By default, your project and task databases contain some of the most important kinds of information associated with these different types of work. But software shouldn't box you in. Every team and person has their own way of working, and with custom properties in Notion, you can build a system that works the way you work. To add properties to your tasks database, click the Add a Property button on any task page, and then pick an option from the drop-down list. For tasks, some of the suggested properties include estimates, description, and dependencies. In these videos, we'll explore sprints and GitHub pull requests. Of course, you can also add custom properties too by scrolling down here. And you can learn more about those in this video. When you add a property, it'll show up on every item in that database as the empty or default value, waiting for you to add details. To customize our website redesign project, we may start by adding an estimates property to the task board. Here, you're prompted with some options of ways that teams commonly estimate task size t-shirt size, and points. For demonstration purposes, we can select t-shirt size. You'll see that this is pre-populated with options that can help you judge the relative weight of your work. You could further customize this by adding your own options, like double XL, if you needed to represent an even larger amount of work. Let's look at the tasks we've created and start to add more information. Recruiting research participants might be a medium task, while each individual interview is relatively small. Add this information on the task pages or in any of the database views. When you start to manage projects in Notion, consider what kinds of information you'll need associated with each task. It can be nice to add these properties early in your process, but they can really be added at any time to help you make sense of what's going on. Before moving to the next lesson, where I'll hand things off to my colleague Kevin, consider adding one or more custom properties to your own project tracker. Happy building.